Karate Kid. The Karate Kid. Ralph Macchio. Ralph Macchio's Top 10. Hey, YouTube. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving deep into the illustrious career of the iconic Ralph Macchio. From the streets of the Karate Kid to the courtroom drama of My Cousin Vinny, we're counting down the top 10 movie moments that showcase the talent and versatility of this Hollywood legend. So, grab your popcorn, sit back, and let's jump into Ralph Macchio's cinematic journey. 10. A Good Night to Die, 2003 Kicking off our list is the action-packed thriller, A Good Night to Die. In this 2003 film, Marchio plays the role of Donny Kirshner, a character caught in the crossfire of a deadly game. It's a departure from his more familiar roles, but Marchio's performance adds depth to the suspenseful narrative, showing us a different side of his acting prowess. 9. My Cousin Vinny, 1992 Coming in at number 9 is the classic courtroom comedy, My Cousin Vinny. In this 1992 film, Marchio plays Bill Gambini, a young man wrongly accused of murder. The movie not only provides us with hilarious courtroom antics but also showcases Marchio's ability to excel in comedic roles alongside heavyweights like Joe Pesci and Marissa Tomei. 8. Distant Thunder, 1988 At number 8, we have the drama Distant Thunder. Released in 1988, this film explores the emotional aftermath of the Vietnam War. Ralph Macchio delivers a poignant performance as Jack Lambert, a troubled Vietnam veteran struggling to reintegrate into society. It's a powerful portrayal that highlights Macchio's ability to tackle complex and emotionally charged characters. 7. Naked in New York, 1993 In the seventh spot, we have the romantic comedy drama Naked in New York. Released in 1993, this film follows the ups and downs of love and ambition in the big city. Marchio plays Chris, a struggling writer navigating the challenges of romance and career. It's a charming performance that adds a touch of romance to Marchio's diverse filmography. 6. The Outsiders, 1983 Breaking into the top half of our list is the 1983 classic, The Outsiders. Adapted from S. E. Hinton's novel, Marchio shines as Johnny Cade, a member of the Greasers gang. The film boasts an ensemble cast of young talent, and Marchio's portrayal of Johnny is both heartfelt and memorable, cementing his status as a rising star in Hollywood. 5. Crossroads, 1986 Taking the fifth spot is the musical drama Crossroads. Released in 1986, this film sees Ralph Macchio stepping into the world of blues guitar alongside the legendary Joe Seneca. Macchio's musical talent is on full display, and his on-screen chemistry with Seneca makes Crossroads a standout entry in his filmography. 4. Hitchcock, 2012 In the fourth position, we have the biographical drama Hitchcock, released in 2012, this film explores the making of Alfred Hitchcock's Psycho. Marchio takes on the role of Joseph Stefano, the screenwriter of the iconic horror film. It's a behind-the-scenes look at the movie-making process, and Marchio's performance adds depth to this cinematic exploration. 3. The Karate Kid Part 3, 1989 Now, let's kick it up a notch to the third spot with The Karate Kid Part 3. Released in 1989, Marchio reprises his role as Daniel La Russo, facing new challenges and adversaries in the world of martial arts. The film further solidifies Marchio's place as a martial arts icon and continues the beloved Karate Kid saga. 2. The Karate Kid Part 2, 1986 Securing the second spot is The Karate Kid Part 2. Released in 1986, this installment takes Daniel and Mr. Miyagi to Okinawa, exploring themes of love, honor, and friendship. Marchio's chemistry with Pat Morita deepens, and his portrayal of Daniel continues to resonate with audiences, making it a pivotal chapter in the Karate Kid series. 1. The Karate Kid, 1984 And finally, claiming the top spot on our countdown is the film that started it all The Karate Kid. Released in 1984, this coming-of-age classic follows the journey of Daniel La Russo as he learns life lessons and karate from Mr. Miyagi. 
Ralph Macchio's portrayal of Daniel remains iconic, making The Karate Kid a timeless and beloved cinematic masterpiece. And there you have it, folks Ralph Macchio's top 10 movie moments. What's your favorite Macchio film? Did it make our list? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more countdowns and movie content. Until next time, this is Chloe, signing off.